There's not one person in this room that I believe doesn't want to see everyone else succeed in this room. And that's the secret to our success. But this has to be your time. You have to find the strength within you to level up. Every time I have anyone doubts me, I use that as energy, as fuel, so I can succeed. I call this the mamba-like mentality. Rest in peace, Kobe Bryant and his daughter, Gigi, an American icon, one of my favorite, favorite basketball players ever on earth, someone I've loved forever. Uh, the other day, the Lakers had did one of the most beautifulest tributes in the universe to Kobe, and uh, I started to tear. I'm sure everybody who watched this cried. It was in memory of him and his daughter. And uh, it was so emotional, I could barely watch. And for sure, the Lakers and the Lakers uh, faithful, they needed this fairy tale ending. They needed the Lakers to win for Kobe that day. And uh, LeBron gave such a beautiful speech. And so they went hard at each other. They played the Portland Trail Blazers. They had Mark in America's own Carmelo Anthony and a young red hot Damian Lillard. So they faced off. And I watched this game, and I wanted the Lakers to win for Kobe, but this guy, Damian Lillard, he wouldn't stop missing. And he was shooting from all over, shooting, shooting, shooting. And LeBron and them kept trying to stop this guy, but they couldn't. It was like he was possessed. So unfortunately, uh, the fairy tale didn't end this the right way. The Blazers won, right? So I watched the interview after the game, and the interviewer, interviewed Damian Lillard, he said, it's like you possessed, you made history tonight. What happened? He said, yo, I did it for Kobe. Hmm. He said, I did it for Kobe. See, it doesn't matter what team you are, if you're on Elizabeth Weber's team or Team Fat Joe or Team whatever, you have to have the Mamba-like mentality in order to succeed. We all in this together.